And the search continues tonight for the person who shot and wounded five people yesterday at a Prince George's County Park. Hundreds of students filled Shrome Hills Park for a senior skip day with shots ring out. Our Dave Laval joins us live with the latest information. Dave, what have you learned? Well, hey there, Ben. We can tell you three of those wounded taken to the hospital have now been released, while a fourth one remains hospitalized. We have not been given an update on the condition of the other person wounded in the attack that took place in the pavilion right behind me. Video posted on social media shows just how large a turnout there was here Friday. Police Chief Richard Bowers believes the students came from Eleanor Roosevelt High, Bowie High and other high schools. All of the wounded are said to be between 16 and 18 years old. Police said they didn't know about the gathering as a similar one took place last year with no issues. That does little to ease the concerns of neighbors we spoke to just a short time ago. To think that this space uh, doesn't feel safe anymore with all these incidents, the neighborhood doesn't feel safe. And I'm thinking like, what is, what is happening to our neighborhoods? What is happening to our kids? What is happening to our teens that is causing them to not have um, a space where they can be safe anymore? And police told us they believe the shooter took off along Hanover Parkway, not far from where I'm standing along with hundreds of other students. You're asked to call police if you have any information. We're live in Greenbelt. Dave Laval, DC News Now.